this is on slow. Ohm's law is named after the great German physicist Georg Simon Ohm. He was born on March 16, 1789 and died on July 6, 1854. Ohm's law states the relationship between electric current and potential difference. Ohm's law in its most basic form states that in simple materials, the amount of current through the material varies directly with the applied voltage and varies inversely with the resistance of the material. Ohm's law states that the voltage across a conductor is directly proportional to the current flowing through it, provided all physical conditions and temperature remain constant. Ohm's law tells us how to calculate the voltage if we know the resistor value and the current flow. The current that flows through most conductors is directly proportional to the voltage applied to it. The voltage drop is analogous to the drop in motor pressure through a small pipe or small nozzle. Ohm's law in a circle form. Since we are using Ohm's law repeatedly as we study electricity, we need a convenient way to remember and use the law. One simple memory key you may find useful is simply draw a circle, divide it half with a horizontal line, then divide it at the bottom half with a vertical line. For the symbol for voltage T in the top half and the letter I, Presenting current and resistance on either side of the vertical line in the bottom up. The vertical line designates multiplication of the quantities on either side of the line. The horizontal line denotes division of the bottom quantity with the value of the top. This is problem number one. is the unknown or voltage is unknown current is by milliampere and the resistance is eight k Using the Ohm's law circle form E is equal to I R. For problem number 1 I is equal to 5 milliampere 5 milliampere is equal to 0 0.005 ampere that is multiplied by 8k ohms or 8000 ohms that is equal to 40 volts this is problem number E is equal to 12 volts or voltage is equal to 12 volts then I or current is unknown R is equal to 
100 ohms. For the solution, using the Ohm's Law circle form, I is equal to E over I. Substitute E, that is 12, and substitute R, that is 100. 12 divided 100, that is equal to 12 ampere. That is the solution for number 2 problem. This is problem number 3, the last problem. A or voltage is equal to 150 volts then I or current is 5 amperes then the unknown is the resistance for the solution using the Ohm's law circle form R is equal to E over I substitute E is 150 volts then substitute I that is 5 amperes the answer is 20 ohms that is how to apply ohms law in a circuit thank you for watching and God bless